Hello everybody. Welcome to the Thursday morning stream. Here on Twitch. I'm here as a hot, sweaty old guy. Oh God, it's hot. <laughs> I look a bit dishevelled. It's because I've just taken the dog out. Come back. Vacuumed. So I'm sweating like a pig. <laughs> There's all the mess. <laughs> but these things happen. Right. Uh, yeah, we're back on to uh, Trails of Cold Steel again. Um, in the downtime, I, I did go back and switch characters. Because apparently we've got a chest in this area. Uh, that we just come into. Uh, Trails chest. And it's Eusis and Machis. So I went and put Machis in. Uses, uses are already in. I went in and got that done. Uh, which reminds me, we need to have a quick look at their quartz again. Type one, like type two. No, the guy does recommend that he has. Uh... I'm not going to use that ammo. A 70% 70, 70 chance to make it soup. Well, I'll put it on when he's cooking. <laughs> Let's see what else we can put on instead of that. Eh? Does reckon, recommend we put on uh, a strong. Water art. So would that be Hydro Cannon R? Oh, that gives him some decent stats, actually. We're giving Flood. Not instead. All right, let's go and have a look what's going on in here then. I'm <sighs> so warm. <laughs> it's killing me. Now's our chance. Let's get him. Oh, we're all full CP. Okay. okay. Uh, Oh, he isn't. Um, I won't switch him out with her. Eliminating targets. I'll switch him out with Sarah, I think. Let's Sarah? Go. Not Sarah. Now's our chance. An opening. Right. Sorry. Would you mind? I'll show you how it's done. Get his CP up. No. You're done. Ready for the trials chest. Oh. Here I go. I'll handle it. Now. There. Kind of shocked how well we go together. As am I, but the result speaks for itself. Well, that's a conversation I've never heard before. I'm going to do most of the fires because we need the sepith as well, so that will come in handy. My turn. Now, an opening. You're finished. Leave this to me. I'll handle this. I'll handle it. My turn. That's that. Let's keep moving.
Ooh. We missed the turn off. Oh, hello. Oh, what the hell is hot? <laughs> supposed to be the hottest day today that we've ever had in the UK. No, it's probably not that hot yet. And it probably won't be here. But it's still bloody hot. Advantage is ours. Let's finish him. I'll handle it. Eliminating targets. Here I go. Second form. Damn! My turn. Hmm. Just attack, get your CP up. Leave this to me. You can finish it, I think. There we go. No escape! Sire! We should keep going. Yeah, I'm definitely not looking forward to doing the uh, the walk in about uh, two hours. <laughs> when it's nearly dinner time, that is going to be horrendous. Oh, Nobody running. There's a treasure chest here. Now's our chance. Let's get him. I'll handle it. Now. I don't feel sorry for these mobs when they come when they're on their own. It's, it's a bit of a shame, really. That's that. Let's keep moving. Oh, look! There's a treasure. Yes, there's a monster chest. Oh, why are you so excited about that? Did we miss the trials chest? We have nothing to fear. Here I go. Now. Let's go everyone. Good morning, Rizzo. How are you? Leave this to me. Nearly 15,000 with a normal hit. <laughs> She's awesome. Ooh. I did it. Quillin, what is that? Oh, good, Rizzo. Very glad. Uh, what's Quillin? Strength 25. Oh, that's a pretty good one. Let's switch that for that, shall we? Whereabouts in the world are you, is it? I've forgotten.
Oh yeah, yeah, it seems that way. Mackie and Juices, here we go. Enemy sighted. Let's take him out. What? Here I go. Nice. Look. Bishop. My turn. Now's our chance. Don't let it pass. Shut up. What? Oh, that's not good, is it? My turn. Take this. My turn. Mm. Holy shit. Protect us. <laughs> right. I'll handle this. Holy shit. Protect us! Right! Hmm. I'll handle this. <sighs> There's no more command walking off it, hasn't it? Now's our chance. Don't let it pass. Shut up. Right. Right. Ah! Very well. Well, that wasn't hard, was it? I thought that was going to be really hard with these two. Oh, that takes care of them. Hang on. What's the door? Oh god, it's so hot! <laughs> no good for an old fat guy like me, this. <laughs> Alright. Where are we up to? Okay. Just in case anything else happens. There'll be another chest here somewhere. Ah, yeah, there is.
Yeah, no. Treasure chest. The advantage is ours. My turn. Eliminating targets. My turn. Second form. Gale! Now! An opening! My turn. This is it! You're done! Onward! Huh? We should keep going. MP2. Switch that out straight away. Right, is that all the chests? No, we have another one. To the other end. Waste of our time. Let's go. Oh, hello. You, you'll fight me, won't you? Yes. Knew you'd fight. Stand your toe. My turn. Eliminating targets. Got it. Get Very well. Right. Leave this to me. <laughs> <laughs> I'll handle this. Training to do. Oh, it's nothing I've missed, is there? We killed Volcaron. Back a minute. Where 
do you want to go? Full speed ahead! Something I want to check on quickly. Christie's Galleria. There's a book place upstairs. Did I get all the books that I needed? Sounds good. Just wanted to make sure before we moved on. I've done Berea hard. The Norwich Canyon. Little trail chest boss. I need to head to Keldig now, I believe. Where do you want to go? Wherever that oh there it is. Party. Elliot. Oh dear, look at the state of Kelm Lake. What a shame. Where's the church? <laughs> Forgotten where the church is. There it is. Okay, I'm about to roar at some point then. Berehard Central Plaza. We were just in Berehard. 
<laughs> Why did you not tell me before? Um, right, okay. So we need to go to Roar. Where do you want to go? Full speed ahead. Roar House, we need. They were upstairs, weren't they? I think, if I remember correctly. To the right, is it? Yeah. Roar House. Alright, uh, proving ground, what do we need now? Where do you want to go? Uh, over here? area. I don't know what I've done, I didn't have this guide, I've been going about all over the place. <laughs> Very hard again. Where do you want to go? Leave it to me. I remember remarking at one point about the uh, guy played the violin.
He's a bit odd. <laughs> Have we got Hibel and Bridget? I don't know we have. Okay, let's go to Keldic. Leave it to me. Hang on a sec. Let me just check this <laughs> before we go any further. Do we have a Bell and Bridget? There's your bell. Oh, right, okay. Challengers. Win without using crafts. Let's move. Okay. okay. Let's see how we do with something like. Uh... Here I go. My turn. Arthas, activate. Four hundred and fifty EP. Okay, we'll, we'll be doing Let's that go. then. Too slow. Now's our chance. An opening. Pants. Here I go. Wow. My turn. Uh, that did a lot of damage. Good job, Elisa. I'm just lucky to be teamed up.
Okay, now we know at least we've got them. Where do you Destination, kill. Leave it to me. Aldic. We're already there. Why is that green? Mm. Are we all slotted out? Oh god, no we're not! Do that one. Save the rest. We need more red sepith. Wasting no time, everyone began working together to set up the stage. <coughs> they did so as quietly as possible, so not to disturb those still recovering. And soon enough, the piano arrived as well. Claire's surname. Of course it is. What? Come on. No longer distracted, they finally started properly setting up for concert. Wasn't long before all was ready. Afterwards, they gather the performers and the rest of the wind orchestra. After a quick meeting and rehearsal, the concert could officially begin. There you go, that'll make you all feel better.
All very nice. The concert went on without a hit, hitch, attract, attracting more and more people over time. One after the other, the transport began to wander into the chapel to hear the music. Even the injured were coming in to listen. Upon looking at the turnout, Class 7 could tell a spark of hope had returned to the people of Keldic. Very nice. I'm very impressed. Very hot. I know that. <laughs> oh, God, it's hot. That was absolutely fantastic. All the people that were unconscious have now woken. Bloody hell. Oh, that's a bit of a surprise. Wasn't expecting that. AP increased by two. Oh, good. Rosine was welcomed aboard the Courageous. And with that, what do we have to do next? Uh, okay, we need a roar. Jackass. Don't remember. Is it the arms place? Probably being Jackass's repair shop, won't he? <laughs> oh dear. the watch. What you need ain't going to be easy. Oh, joy. Thank you. 
Research facility, okay. Iron mine, okay. Micro oscillator. Research was this way, wasn't it? I think. Memory so. Hello. Sorry to interrupt you playing with your little cars. Gregor and Harv's what they were up to and asked about the type 4 pressure regulator. Okay, that was easy enough for the first one. Right, we need to get to the mines. Uh, Sasha Mountain Pass. This is the way, if I remember correctly. So we've got to run all the way there. Yeah, you're going to run. My turn. You're quite safe at the moment, monsters. Not going to come for you unless I see something worth fighting. You'll fight, will you? That one looks nasty. Try to be careful, everyone. Maybe not. Watch out. This is a tough one. Okay. Eliminating target. Got it. There. Here I go. Second form. Damn. Now's our chance. An opening. Handle this. Leave this to me. Huh? We should keep going. Ooh, a level up. Wasn't the person I was expecting it to be. 115, okay.
Okay. Very well. Here I go. Leave this to me. Explain you were looking for a special alloy sheet. Gotta go inside. Chess or anything that we missed? No. Just check in. Very kind of you, sir. Thank you. Granddad, isn't it? It's the one. It's all by the dock in the house, I think. Oh, well, we've not been here for a while. He's not there. <laughs> of course, he's not where I would expect him to be. Explain that they were trying to fix the pocket watch that Elise's father made and asked about the micro oscillator. George's got a spare piece.
Without the hurry back to the courageous, I went straight to speak to George. It's a good that we brought all that as a Murray and Orr bike. Oh, it's really dropped us there. Okay. <laughs> He's winding you up. With that, they immediately set out for the Ryanford family residence to collect his tools and fix the pocket watch. Et voilà Oh, I wouldn't say we're going to give it back to her. <laughs>
Gosh, it's so matter of fact, her mother. Dear, dear, dear. I'm sure it's an act. Seraph. No, that is. She will shed a tear. Right, what is that? What is Seraph? Shining Seraph ring, wherever that is. No clue what that is. to do next then. Okay, we've, cl we've cleared all of the other shrines. Turn to the courageous. Report. <laughs> Have you been keeping well? Not too bad, mate. Do tell me all about what you've been up to. Fifteen thousand five hundred mirror of completing the quest. Marvelous! You've ranked up. up. This is just a little something from me. Aura jacket two. Well, well, that's very impressive. Adios, Reen. Student information. Oh, is this monk? Not 
Put a minus 30 on him. No. No. Yes. Alright, okay. What did that say? Really a proving ground. No, we can get him back yet. Quick walk. Where do you want to go? Proving ground. Leave it to me. So a quick look. See if we can find him. Not even sure if we've done what we need to do to get him, but we'll find out. Oh, hang on a minute. ages ago. <laughs> Got that about three or four episodes ago, I think. Just, just forgot to come back and give it him. I'm sorry it took us a long night. It was my totally my fault. <laughs> Turn to the courageous. sending me messages right I think we can go to the hall and speak to George then now and he's not in there as he's in there So let's, let's, let's advance it. As a result, all unfinished quests will disappear. Uh, just one second, a minute. Just let me check. <laughs> uh, quest. Yeah, they're all reported. Okay. They went about making the best looking workspace they could. Afterwards, George made contact with the Roar Institute of Technology. Made contact, sorry. 
And the time finally came to welcome Professor Schmidt on board to the courageous old joy. What a miserable git he is. <laughs> Is such an ass. Yes, yes, that is the famous Professor G. Schmidt. Schmidt. Tachi Gan. George Professor Schmidt worked as quickly as they could, but Class 7 would be ready when the time for the final battle with Crow came. While they were working, the Courageous received a sudden and unexpected call. Are you sure, Captain? Voice acting, yes. Yes, absolutely. Several days ago, the Alliance moved their line of defense around the capital westward, which means that the east side of the capital, and in particular the area around Trista, are much more exposed than before. That could totally work in our favor. Lucky us. Mm. Yeah. It sounds like we might finally be able to achieve what we set out to do. We finally have a chance to wrestle the Academy from the Alliance's grasp. I guess the Alliance is so focused on trying to defend Heimdall, they don't have time to worry about Trista. We couldn't have asked for a better chance than this. I have some other news that may be of interest to you as well. The Noble Alliance forces are no longer the ones supervising Thor's military academy. Instead, they've assigned that task to the upper class students so the army can focus on defending the capital. Why the upper class students? I imagine they were chosen so the academy would technically still be under the control of the nobility. I'm sure they're up to the task either way. Are we talking about all of the upper class students or just a select number of them? The academy is being overseen by a group of students calling themselves the Order of the Lion. The group is centered around high-ranking nobles, and its commander is one of the sons of Marquis High Arms, Patrick T. High Arms. Surprise, surprise, Patrick. Patrick. <laughs> I heard that he was still at the academy, but just what is he doing? And what's this Order of the Lion? <laughs> I know nobles love tradition, but that name sounds like something torn from a history textbook. Other key members include the son and daughter of Count Florald, together with a butler and maid from the upper-class dormitory. To my knowledge, the principal and the other instructors remain imprisoned within the academy itself, however. Ferris is taking part too? If I had to wager a guess, the Alliance ordered them to. Not like they're in a position to refuse. That's a little worrying. Principal Van Dyke is an honorary general of the army as well, so naturally, the army is concerned for his well-being. As such, we of the RMP are preparing to liberate Trista and the Academy from the nobility. It will be carried out before the battle for Heimdall can begin, using our most elite units. Oh. But, but that means... Mortal Captain, units, class seven. Would you consider postponing your operation <laughs> for at least a few days? Green. Do you not think the RMP is up to the task? I don't doubt for a moment that you are. But since the day we were entrusted with the courageous, no, even before that, 
liberating the Academy has been our dream. I don't just mean Class 7's dream, either. It's something that every single student gathered on this ship wants to be a part of. You could even say it's our duty. Whether someone else could handle it isn't the issue. It's what we've come this far for. We want to do it with our own hands. Thank you, Reen. <sighs> I feel the same way as Reen does. Thor's was established by one of my ancestors, so I feel a connection to it in that sense. It feels only right that those who have an attachment to the Academy should come together to take it back. She's absolutely right. We've come all this way believing it would lead us back to the Academy. We can't just leave the last step of our journey to you. After all that's happened, I think we're the ones who should be fighting that Order of the Lion, don't you? Yeah, you're right! Yep, it's gotta be us. We've all put an enormous amount of effort into making it this far. It's only fair, right? <laughs> we wouldn't be setting a very good example as second years if we didn't see tasks we've taken on through to the end. I want to go and save Uncle Makarov, too! That's a lot of yes votes right there. <laughs> I'm pleased to see we're all unanimous. Yeah, I want to do this too, Claire. Really, Milliam? You too? So, Captain, please, won't you leave taking back Trista and the Academy to us? We realize we're asking a lot, but this is genuinely important to us. When I finally see Dad again, I want to be able to look back and feel proud of all I've done. I was never raised to beg, but in this case, no price is too great. I wasn't expecting to get quite so strong a reaction from you. It's almost like we went to different schools. I've never felt quite the devotion and attachment to the Academy all of you clearly possess, so it's a little strange for me to see how much each of you are willing to sacrifice, just so you can liberate Trista together. <laughs> but strange in a good way. Is that a yes? We'll wait two days. Trista will form a vital base in our operation to take Heimdall. It needs to be liberated as soon as possible. I hope that will be enough time for you to achieve your dream of taking it back. <sighs> Thank you, Captain. <laughs> if you weren't with the RMP already, you'd make a hell of an actress, you know. You put on quite a show for someone who was going to say yes all along. <laughs> now what makes you say that? Regardless, I will be praying for your success. I look forward to seeing you all again in Heimdall after this war is over. Thank you. Good luck to you too, Captain. Okay, looks like we're going to be taking Trista back. Finally, Class 7 was granted permission to liberate Trista. They left assigning the specifics of the operation to Tower, and eventually it was decided that they would carry out their mission the same day. A prototype of Valimar's new Tachi was completed. Very nice. Thursday, Trista's liberation. The operation will begin today at 1200 hours. Make sure you've done everything you need to do before then. As you already know, I won't be taking part in this one. This one's all you. My job as your teacher is to stay here and wish you luck. I know you can do it. Thank you. We've still got some time until then, so it might be worth going around and making sure we've got all we need. Yeah, we can't be too prepared. No, nope, we can't. Time. That's a good plan. Incidentally, <laughs> how goes the development of Valimar's Tachi? The prototype was finished last night. There's still some work left before it's completely finished. But personally, I'd say the progress we've made is nothing to scoff at. Professor Schmidt's really something, isn't he? I guess. But he could lighten up a little. I went to go play down in his workshop and he was all super mad at me. <laughs> Were you expecting to be welcomed with a hug and some candy? Anyway, by the sound of it, he's going to keep finding ways to improve it until the very last minute. I'm going to be swamped with helping him out, but... I should still be able to tune your Arcus units if you guys need it. We just might take you up on that, George. We might. Whatever ensures you're as ready as possible. So much is resting on this battle. I don't want us to go in with any regrets. Right. All members of Class 7 will take part in the battle for Trista, whether they are active party or not. This is the two-party thing that I read about. As such, make sure you check everyone's equipment, including that of characters you may not ordinarily use. To advance the main story, speak to Tor in the captain's chair and select commence operation. Oh, 
Okay, and we will do that next time, guys. It's going to be time to take the dog out, so I'm going to go on out and sweat my proverbials off. <laughs> so thanks for being with me. Thanks for watching. I shall see you all soon. We shall be back on Trails of Cold Steel tomorrow morning and continue from here. See you later, guys. All grey. Signing off. <laughs>